everyone, and welcome back to some more Way 2. Are you excited? Well, you're playing a gotcha game. I guess you're not very excited. <laughs> I didn't even know you started recording. <laughs> yeah, whenever I, ta I hop on the, the on the bed and whatnot, that's when I started. You can even see the stop recording button in the corner. <laughs> well, yeah, but I'm just saying, you didn't say anything. Oh, sorry. I said, are you ready? You went, yeah. Huh? <laughs> Anyways. In the last one... We went to Route 9, we got- we beat up all the trainers on there, we called them Stinky, and then we went back to Upalista City, we beat up Drayden. Called and, him Stinky. Yeah, we called him Stinky. We didn't want to be oiled up and- and, <laughs> yeah, he was, he and was, wrestle with his Pokemon. He was too gross to wrestle with him, unfortunately. Yeah, I mean, he is old, so... Is he old, or is- or is this just like- is his stuff- like his hair just white? Cause you know, there's there's like there's like some there's some people in like these these shows and whatnot that have like white hair. Well, excuse them, but um, <laughs> that have like white hair, but they're like not old characters. Mm -hmm. I don't know. What do you think? Well, well, Iris called him Grandpa. Well, yeah, I but, think he's sixty. I, I, I think like Iris is like kind of like a troll. <laughs> like <laughs> she's like he. He's an old four. He's like I'm 27. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like I feel like someone. Well, I can't tell. I can't tell if like uh, if he's like an old guy, like uh, like Master Roshi from like Dragon Ball, or mm -hmm. he's like he's like big muscled up, a muscled up dude, or if he's like just some dude that like looks old. Mm-hmm. Cause it said he wrestles with his Pokemon. You wouldn't expect some 80 year old to be like, Yo, Haxorus, let's go get down and dirty. I mean, maybe he just built different. Imagine, imagine that. He's like 80 years old. He's like walking with his cane. And and he's like, Come on, Haxorus, let's go fight. And the ha Haxorus like touches him. He's like, Oh, my fucking back! <laughs> my spleen just striped shirt. <laughs> Alright. This way. <laughs> that way. Do you know the way? <laughs> no, I meant this way. <laughs> We're here. Okay, come inside. Man, that was really far. I would have gotten lost. <laughs> you you just saw my character go into the trees and be like, Whoa, you found a hidden grotto. Would you like to go in there? Would you like to catch the Dragonite? <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you the story. It's a long story, but let's look. Oh my god. Let me god. tell you a story all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down, and I'd like to take a minute just sit right there. <laughs> It was two years ago when the two dragon Pokemon were awakened. Dragon being lowercase seems like so out of place there. I mean, it's kind of like when you when they would like replace the sentence with dog. That makes sense too. No, but like th think about it. When they talk about like the original dragon, it's like capitalized. But yeah. But in this case, since it's he's just using dragon as an adjective, it's it's not. It just seems off. Mm -hmm. The white dragon Pokemon, Reshiram, sought what is true with the desire to usher in a new world of goodness. And the black Pokemon... <laughs> and the black dragon Pokemon... Okay, it would have fit either way. Zekrom pursued what is ideal with the desire to usher in a new world of hope. Reshiram and Zekrom were once a single Pokemon. You may wonder why it's split in two. The single dra It's because of mitosis. <laughs> the single dragon Pokemon had helped the twin heroes bring a new region into being, but the twin heroes, the younger brother who sought ideals and the older brother who sought the truth, sundered the region in two as they fought to see which of them was right. In, what, in that desperate hour, the single dragon Pokemon split its body into a white Pokemon and a black Pokemon, even though ideals and truth don't need to be in opposition. Let me pace back and forth. As the story goes, a third dragon Pokemon, Kirin, also came into existence in that era. And there may be proof of this to be found in a treasure passed down in my family for generations. The DNA Splicers. Professor Juniper's research determined that the materials in the Splicers date back to the same era as the materials used in building the Dragon Spiral Tower. Sorry if I sounded a little bit quieter at the moment. She just abruptly jumped in front of me. I wanted to get gum. <laughs> Wow, it's like it's like your version of popcorn for the story. You're just <laughs> yeah. chewing gum. Yeah, wait, hold on. Oh, don't worry. The DNA splicers are stored very safely. I guarantee no one will steal these items from me. They are very, very safe. I want it to be very clear that these will not be fallen into the hands of any evildoers. Okay, that seems pretty safe then. I guard them because I don't know what kind of power might lie within them. But here's what's been bothering me. Could there be one more dragon Pokemon? Even if Kyurem really exists, 
We don't know what kind of Pokemon it is. For starters, the two Pokemon the ancient the two Pokemon the ancient Pokemon split into are both overwhelmingly powerful. So if Kyurem exists, could it just be a husk? A shell that was left over? Boom! 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 I dear hope that those are not the bad guys that I was foreshadowing. <laughs> <laughs> hmm? What was that sound? What was that noise? There are footprints here. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? You just asked that. Oh my god, this is so epic. <laughs> How in the fuck is that thing flying? <laughs> With the engines. Oh look, you can see the Pokemon Center from here. <laughs> you think they're gonna be like terrorists? Oh gee, I dear, I really hope that they don't shoot a freezing bolt of ice at our town. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh shit! Oh thank goodness, they didn't just shoot a freezing bolt, they shot multiple. Yeah. At least our, our- I thought they shot the sidewalk, they didn't shoot at any buildings or anything. Yeah. They're not trying to cause casualties, they're trying to just prove a point. I guess. A little bit of- They, they say that, they're, they're, like, they're like, I'm just trying to prove a point, and then there's like, there's like, uh, someone who's just like, out walking their fish, and they're, j <laughs> and they're just dead on the sidewalk. And they're like, oh. Whoops. Womp womp. <laughs> the world of ice. Haxorus, use dragon tail. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> That's enough, Haxorus. That was awful. He got More training for you. <laughs> he got scared of the ice. I'm just what happened. <laughs> oh, sorry. I can't this believe you're gone. This here. long story is making me <laughs> really <laughs> tired. that long. <laughs> not only did the ice stay unbroken, there's not even a s single scratch on it. What's going on? I don't think that's going to work. I remember you from End's castle. It's bitter cold. I'm shivering. I'm suffering, but I'm alive. That's what the essence of life feels like. It's proof of my existence. But that's enough of philosophy. Here are the facts of your admiration. This ice is especially created by Team Plasma's technology. As long as we have our secret weapon, you'll never be able to melt or break this ice. Let me explain our purpose here. Drayden, hand over the DNA splicer that you alluded to right here before. <laughs> Abelus's city is a city where the past and the future are entwined. Could this be a, a more perfect play for the splicer that connect the two separate Pokemon? I, I made sure to foreshadow this event. This is a canon event. <laughs> Do you think someone who knows what you did two years ago will just hand them over quietly? Hmm. I specifically said they will not fall into your hands. <laughs> That's what I thought you'd say. At this point, I'd like to threaten you with another voltage of ice. But we can't use it for a moment. It, it, would, it wouldn't be as enjoyable in this cold, but I guess we'll just search for them. Those foul villains! Phoenix, I want you to help me. We're going to drive Team Plasma out of Opelucid City. Why do I gotta help? Oh, the music here is really good. Wait, I think you battled that guy at the bottom. Not the ice physics, I hate the ice physics. Oh, I thought you battled him. I can't, I can't believe, believe his hacksaw has blasted me all the way over here. I think. That old guy won't hold back even if his opponent is a young girl. They're getting tougher. Phoenix, take care of the others. We're trying. Motherfucker, I'm trying to find who else is. Okay, I guess Pokemon he's one of them. Pokemon are pawns. They are means to an end. That's what I was taught. Don't think about it too much. It's easier that way. He's like, don't think about the crippling depression that you have. It's easier that way. Yeah, me too, bitch. <laughs> I'm challenged by Team Plasma Grunt. Wow, well, watch out. Do you think it has Confused Ray, Hyper Fang, Super Fang, and, and Hypnosis? Probably. 
Oh wait, I gotta read our favorite commenter's comment. Yeah, while well, I see- Oh no, it has mean look. Oh, Jesus, we're gonna die now. Yeah, read, read, uh, read his comment while I sit here and, uh, and beat up this watchhog, and then his second watchhog that he definitely has. Oh, he has a luck. Wait, I can switch poke. Wait, can I- can I really switch Pokemon? Uh, there's so much for him using mean look. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I was like, what- yeah, I was like, yeah, what's the problem? You've always been able to switch out your Pokemon. Oh, mean look only works when- They're alive. Yeah, forgot about that. And that thing is not alive anymore. No, unfortunately it's dead. Holy shit, Muck is so tanky. There it is. I don't know what the fuck we were talking about in this episode, to be completely honest with you. It's, uh, in Charged Stone Cave, episode 12. <laughs> Think I remember? I don't remember. I can't even remember what I had for breakfast today. I had two pieces of toast. You little, you knocked out my stupid pawns. I hope he knows that he he is also a stupid pawn in this operation. How could this be? Is there some kind of power Pokemon have when they're not treated like objects? POV women. I'm sorry. <laughs> Anyway. Bye bye. <laughs> You're gonna leave. <laughs> I, I didn't think you could actually leave. <laughs> Man, now we don't get the we beat the gym leader anymore because you entered there. Oh my bad. Hmm. Good question. There are probably a variety of reasons for evolutionary lines to span across generations, but most of them probably share from the core reasoning of they just had a new idea. For baby Pokemon, I imagine they wanted to make them even more marketable, like a Zoomeral. Sometimes maybe. They take a look at the old Pokedex entries and get new ideas from them. Like, and a fill a date. Annihilate. Thank you. Sometimes it's probably. Sometimes it's probably to expand on previous ideas, like Magnezone. You know what I find funny about Trampish? It has the exact base attack stat as Flygon. Its attack actually goes down for a brief period of time as, as in its mobile evolution. No wonder it was so fucking weak. That makes so much sense, because Trap Inch did, did a good amount of damage. Yeah. But fucking Vibrava did nothing. <laughs> Vibrava fell off hard. Yeah. That, that actually makes so much sense, and now that it's back to a Flygon, it actually does, does damage. Does decent damage. Oh no, it has fucking acrobatics! I forgot that Electro Ball works off the speed, and since it's really fast, it doesn't do that much. Mm hmm. I gotta use it on someone slow, like a, like a ground type. Good one. Mm -hmm. uh, I strived to innovate. You know what? Put fucking yeah, put Pringles in. I'm gonna throw out Pringles. We use a lot of uh, normal type Pokemon anyway. Oh uh, yeah, you can't. I, I have the option to switch again. I think that's cheating. I'm gonna stay in. Oh uh, yeah, you saw me like when you walked in and whatnot. Of uh, I was working on my cosplay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to style the wig, and I was like, oh wait, I have- I went downstairs in the basement to grab, like, the- like, the mannequin head. And also, while I was down there, I found the hairspray that I stole from my mom. And I was like, perfect, they can use this! It won't spray out of the bottle, so I had to untwine it and, like, dangle the little line. And then, like, on it. <laughs> Doesn't fucking spray. How humiliating, being bothered by a bother. I'm so bothersome, and you've bothered my bothersome bother. Hey, you think there's anyone in there? This time- oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> this time! <laughs> she doesn't even get to finish this sentence. Oh shit, you know what I saw this morning on the way to work? What's that? From the fucking cyber trucks. Oh yeah, apparently somewhat popular around here. I've only seen two. And I told my dad about it, because he called me. I was like, hey dad, you know what I saw around, around these parts? I saw- I saw one of those hyper trucks, and he's like, "Really? What did it look like?" I'm like, "It looked fucking stupid." That's what it looks like. It's all. It's all. Uh, I love how like the like other Tesla models are like kind of like rounded compared to like most cars, and then the Cybertruck is like the complete opposite. It's, it's, just, it's just geometric. I gotta have you watch the Drew Gooden video I saw of. Uh, he was talking about like the, the more like the modern cars that have like stupid some of the features are because some of them like. It can be dangerous when the driver's trying to, like, adjust settings, because everything's touchscreen now, and there's so many different menus that it can be dangerous to, like, 
fix that while you're going like 70 miles an hour. Yeah. And then he was talking about how stupid the fucking Tesla Cybertruck was. Is there any chance this thing doesn't have levitating? Just try it. Yes. Yeah, okay. No, oh, no, it had levitate. That makes sense. I don't know what I was expecting. You expected it not to have levitate, that's exactly what you thought. Wait, why am I expecting this to do more than Dragon Tail? I don't know. Should have done a fair amount. Hmm. Oh, yeah, shit. Goggles is poisoned. Goggles, stop being useless for five fucking seconds. Th this is the big problem we have with our team. We somehow built our entire team around the fact that if they have a poison type with Levitate, we have nothing against it. We can get someone with a psychic move, right? Doesn't Pringles learn psychic? I mean, it probably Pringles probably can, but I don't know where we get psychic at. Probably post game. Probably. Here, I'll look it up. I'll be useful while I sit here and you play the game. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go... He said something about the Pokemon gym. I'm gonna ignore it and go heal our Pokemon. You go in there and like, do 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 <laughs> Yep. <laughs> Yep. All these people are like, oh, By golly, it's so it's such a nice day. I'm so glad I didn't go outside and get blasted by ice. Yo, yeah, that is so me. I'm also glad I didn't get blasted by ice. <laughs> they just like me for real, for real. Can I get on my bike while, while there's ice That's the description. Huh, I never... Huh, I never done that before. <laughs> you, I, feel like, I feel like I'm going slower. Oh. <laughs> Alright, final talk. What would have happened if you went to the gym before? That's a fantastic question. That guy, tell me what happens. <laughs> oh, for crying out loud. I didn't expect to have to fight. To fight. Wait, hammered? Hampered. Oh, hampered by cold like this. Well, no matter. The fact that I'm shivering means I'm truly alive. I keep forgetting to take. Maggie out of the front. Well, I guess it's fine. I mean, we're going up. He's probably at the Krog and all that first, right? Yeah. Yep. No, tell me where the fuck this move is. Tell me about the rabbit's door. <laughs> Did I really sound like that? Is that why you said that? A little bit. All right. Tell so, me back to rabbit. So there's Krog and all, which means that I should throw out goggles into this thing. Yeah. No. <laughs> Good job, Maggie. You bit it. Oh, we gotta put Maggie down. Don't say that. It's not good for the children. Oh, I wonder what Pokemon this could be. He has such a unique team. For a guy that hates ice, why does he have so many fucking ice types? I don't know. Matter of convenience, I guess. Aha, here it is. No way he predicted I was gonna use a... Special it's on round 13! Oh, didn't we- Do we have to have Waterfall to get it? I'm looking... Items. We get the Draco plate. And the Splash plate. Oh wait, that's the- that's the first game. Hold on. No, what the fuck happened? Near Fisherman Vice. Requires Surf. Oh. I think it's one of the islands. On that route. Where were fishermen vices? That's where we gotta get psychic. <laughs> Pringles can probably learn it. What? Psychic? Yeah. I think so. No. I mean, no, Pringles can learn fucking like energy ball. Have yeah. you gotten even stronger than you were in Lacunosa Town? How? In such a brief amount of time. Mm -hmm. I'll do the reading. You're a strong trainer. You definitely are adept at handling Pokemon. I believe I'll take my leave, simply because I can't fucking stand this cold. But imagine this. Wow, my balls <laughs> on your forehead. Huh? I didn't know he said that. Alright, I'm glad you ignored what I said. I saw, I heard what you said. A, a Unova region completely covered in ice. To achieve that splendor, we'll do whatever it takes to obtain the DNA splicers. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Jump scare. Oh man! You're even better than uh I hoped. Thanks to you, we drove them off. I'm grateful to your Pokemon also. After all that, the least I can do is heal them with this medicine. It's like the like the revival herb and they're like 
Why, why is it spicy? <laughs> Wait here a moment. I'll be right back. Oh, he was right back. Harumph! That's a new record for making it there and back. Look, Phoenix, these are the DNA splicers that I totally will not let fall into evil's hands. Ooh! That's a thumbnail of the video. <laughs> this is what they were after. We're really fortunate Team Plasma didn't get their hands on them. I don't know what their goal is, but I'm sure they're planning something wicked. As we expected, the hiding place is the gym. Well thought out. If Draven wasn't there, we, could, we can't get in. If he is there, he's the strongest guard that we can possibly face. It also explains why the Pokemon Gym was remodeled. Whatever. The DNA Spicers are now in our hands. It's beyond my imagination to think you'd use one of the Seven Sages to find out where the Spicers were. Now you know then. We will accomplish our goals, no matter what the cost. We don't have the ability to, to captivate the hearts of others like Lord N does. Instead, we will blend ourselves into... Wait, we will blend people to our will with brute force. Bend, not blend. <laughs> Two years was a surprisingly long wait. Uh, I gotta go find those fuckers. If they've uh, if they've been stolen from us, we'll just have to take them back. I think he went over to the exit. Oh shit! There's one right there. Maybe she got the bike. <laughs> Maybe you should get off the bike. It's very serious. <laughs> yeah. You don't really think you can take the DNA Spicer back, do you? Yeah, I do. I don't oh. think you ever faced the Shadow Triad in the first game. Nope. Are they girls? I don't know. I think they are ambiguously gendered. He, he just like me. He just like me for real, for real. <laughs> Man, it's a good thing that you're playing, because I would have been like, oh, it's steel, and then pressed, like, heat crash. <laughs> I mean, I probably would have killed it, but... Mm -hmm. Axel. Oh, you know what that calls for? Another arm draws. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's future sight. It's predicting the future. Your future calls for you not getting any bitches. We don't have a dark type. No, we do not. Is this where we replace Maggie? <laughs> no, M Maggie's doing great. Good job, Apple. I hope you can tank this future site. <laughs> oh yeah, shit. Sure. Apple is the goat. Actually, he's the bug, but... Oh, yeah, this Ponyard's gonna get fucking punched. Huh! <laughs> Huh. <laughs> Where do we get brick break in this game? No fucking clue. Let me look it up. I hate to admit it, but you're a good trainer. Dang, I can't believe that these guys are moving around this fast when they have oh. nine grand on them. <laughs> oh, how unlucky. I didn't happen to be the one holding the DNA spicer. I was just, just buying time for the others to escape. Cheerio. Bye-bye. Whatever. <laughs> Oh no! Ah, oh, no! No, no, it's not your fault, Phoenix. You're impressive. It's me who's let everyone down. Oh my gosh, is this Curtis? No. <laughs> no, it's fucking Charon. Oh shit! Oh, it, well, actually, it is Charon. Phoenix. A strange ship was flying toward Opelucid City, right? I, I saw it too. I'm in route. Charon, that's Team Plasma's ship, isn't it? Yes, no doubt about it. Anyway, I'll be arriving in one moment. Okay, I'll leave things to you. Phoenix, if you run into any trouble, call me. We call him. What the fuck do you want? <laughs> oh, if there were only two of me, then I could protect the town and chase after them too. 
I'm en route. <laughs> Phoenix, Draven, glad to see that you're safe as well. Hello, Chair. You have certainly grown. I hear you filled in for Lenora by becoming the gym leader in Aspersha City. Thanks. We should catch up later on. I have a good idea where Team Plasma is hiding. The place with the lowest temperature in the Universe region right now is the is the area closest to um um El a sit thank you. <laughs> Drayden, please protect Appaloosa City. Hugh and I will find T Plasma. Very well, I'll do my part. And thanks. The chase I'll leave to you. But don't do anything reckless. Phoenix, I will use your help if you're willing to. You're a skilled trainer who can go to who, who can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Team Plasma. That's my definition of useful. Unlike Bianca. <laughs> Bianca's a fucking terrible Bianca's shitter. Bianca's a, sh a shit trainer. Drayden, I'll be off. Humalau City, huh? Is there anything to this north of Undela Town? Phoenix, protect Pokemon from Team Plasma. All people should think for themselves about the nature of the relationship between people and Pokemon. It's not something Team Plasma gets to decide for everyone. <laughs> you having fun, buddy? It's it's hard with the bike sometimes, but it's okay. I'm I'm doing great. Heal, 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 heal. This is the strat. It makes it go by point zero 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 one seconds faster. You know, that's always what I thought as a kid, and it never makes them go any faster. Oh, they actually do say shit. <laughs> oh, I thought it was chilly. <laughs> Maybe the metal guy will have special dialogue if you talk to him. No, I, I do not think he will. Alright, so... You do know at some point we're, we're going to go talk to him, right? Yeah, and at some point is not now. <laughs> so... We, can... we should talk to him after we beat the main game. <sighs> you know what? Uh, on the last episode, we can talk to him. Okay. You sit there for 30 minutes? <laughs> My phone's ringing. Phoenix, where are you? On Delatown. Got it. From there, go through the marine tube and come straight to Humalau City. Oh, yeah. There is a tube. Where the fuck are you? Oh, you get the psychic? Yeah. Oh yeah, I was gonna look at Brick Break and then I forgot. Mm -hmm. So we need Surf to get it, which means it's in a surfable spot. Which We, we never battled You can buy game. Brick Break from the lady on the left after that's, that's getting right. 12 battle points. That's right, that's right. I, I remember mentioning that. And we're like, fuck no, we ain't doing <laughs> Alright, Miguel, your Pokemon are about to get poopied on. I better get arm thrusted, bitch. Oh my gosh, you're gonna do seven damage to me. Oh, that did like 16. Well, at least it hurt itself. Yeah, I think it did more damage to itself than it did to me. Honestly, I gotta say, I love her coat. It's so fetch. It's so shit. Ooh, where'd you get that? Fucking Goodwill. <laughs> All right, electric. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. You'd rather put in Pringles? <laughs> also. Wait, did it say electric or electros? Well, you either way, you can't use ground type on it. Oh, no, but it can't use electric on us. Yeah. Ow. Oh. Send him to the shadow realm. Oh, it's the last one. It would be kind of unfair if if you can use Dragon Tail in the first turn. Yeah. I wish it learned Dragon Rush instead. But it's fine. Maybe later on? Ultra Ball. Hey, I'm gonna Ultra Ball. Is this the Fisherman? Are you Fisherman Vice? No, I think it's... I think it's up there. Okay, I'm gonna ignore that Fisherman then. A heart scale. <laughs> Yay! I think it's yeah. I think it's up there on that island. There's a bunch of little islands everywhere. Oh yeah, there. I think that's it right there. Or, or that right there. 
or that right there. I was gonna say, why do I feel like this is a fungus? Me see the. I think that's psychic. Yeah, you're probably right. I couldn't remember. Yep. I couldn't remember. All right, let's see if anyone can learn it. It's like Maggie can learn it. The character with like no special attack. I mean, Maggie probably can freaking learn it. Oh, Pringles can. Yeah. Why did the, Why did it say you couldn't? Uh, Are we really, really gonna use recover? No. Yay! Only attack moves for my Pokemon. Wait, did we get Shadow Ball? We got Shadow Claw. Yeah, we gave it to Levani. Yeah, go for it. Do we ever get Shadow Ball? I feel yeah. like. Why do I feel like it's in like the or it's called the Victory Road? Yeah, probably. All right. Mom, where are A lot of the good teams are in post game. Yeah. Like earthquake and earthquake and. No. Earthquake. Are you seriously saying the flag on does not learn earthquake? Uh. I don't think it learns it in time. Oh. Is the marine tube this way? No, no, no. It's uh in town. Cameron. Oh, that's right. Cameron. Yeah, there it is. Into the tube we go. I love going in tubes. The marine tube is ha Oh no, I, th I, th I thought that this was a plane. I'm here, just- <laughs> The marine tube. It's the undersea tunnel, so to speak. Do you know how those tunnels are made? It's quite simple. They built it on land, and then they sunk it in the sea. Without Pokemon, the construction would have been impossible. All right. Maybe that's why we don't have cool things in, in this world. We need Pokemon to exist. How the fuck they put lights underneath the water? <gasps> look! It's a basculin! And a- Oh my god, look at all the Pokemon! You're not looking at uh, them! I am looking at them. I have- I have one thing in mind though. Alright. We're going to go- keep going through this tube until we find Whale Lord. Is he in here? You can find a Whale Lord in here. Look at the- any- the jealous hex. So pretty. Yeah, there there is a chance for a whaler to be You're here. Right. I, I, I just want to show it off because it's it's something cool. All I see are Basque legions in in the blue fucker. It might take us a second, but I see baby Pringle and Basque legion. It's like it's not that common to see one, but it's all it also I don't think is that rare. Gotcha. I wanna know how the fuck they get lights working underneath the water, man. Like they all get street poles. I don't know. They they, they took they took some prismarine from from Minecraft and <laughs> and, and threw it underwater. Alright, I'll go I'll go through I'll go through this back once and then one more time and if we don't see it then we'll just leave. Cause I, I don't I don't want this to be too boring, even though I do want to go see the whale lord. How come there's no other water type Pokemon in here? I don't know. Alright. Yay! We found nothing! I apologize for wasting everyone's time, just know you can't see a whale lord. We might come back to it at some point. Oh, wait, wait, get off, get off the bike, get off the bike! Go stand in the- in the mouth. It's a face board. Oh, wait, do the girl one? Hold on. Back out. Now go back in. Oh. There's, there's sometimes a guy would come by and you'll have like another person and he's like, all right, go in there, kid, and then take a picture of you. Damn. Maybe all right, I'm sad. gonna ignore you, Hugh. Look at these two. <laughs> I oh. love doing, I love doing the thing where like you, uh, you go like in between them mm -hmm. and and then it like makes it so that they're like going like the opposite way. 
<laughs> if I can do it. Wait, do they just not- Oh, they just don't have a space between them. Yeah. Oh wait, no, I got this. Nothing can separate them. I have to stop the guy. Yeah, I don't think you can. You're- <laughs> I'm you just- I'm just doing things that are wasting everyone's time. <laughs> 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 we'll get the DNA splicers back for sure. So you should focus on defeating the gym leader first. Cool. Cool, I'm gonna ignore you and go up and see a cool route in this fat guy. Are you taking on the gym leader? But he- but you can't- can't find old Marlin? He does whatever he wants. Yeah, isn't he like all the way up here or something? I don't know, probably. So, you go over here. Yep, and then it's this route. And then it's... <laughs> that then took so long. And then the game crash. <laughs> Our battle will surely be worth a page in the book of your journey. Why you suddenly like, teach for a second? Our battle will be legendary. <laughs> oh yeah, when I got burger buns, I got two packs of them. Okay. So now we have eight. Because yeah. they never want to restock for gluten-free bread at, at Oh, time. I accidentally hit run. <laughs> you can't run away. I Why can't. Why don't you put Le Why don't you put Levanium? It's a psychic type. So? Psychic's weak against bug. Psychic's weak, weak against ghost, too. Okay. Well, Lee Vanny's also grass. What the? You... I just got outplayed! Outgunned! Outbanned! Outnumbered! Outplanned! I'm right. so cool. I'm such a theater kid. Even though I never was in theater. Alright, what's Drapion nice gonna school. use? Night Slash? Back that's, slash. that's still gonna hurt. Quick, use Earth Power. That's a crit. Holy shit, he's dead! <laughs> Why not he doing so good, man? We should give him some fucking protein powder. <laughs> yeah, for real, for real. I just got actually so outplayed. I'm gone. I'm so glad this thing's only looking against brown, man. That's so cool. It's okay. It's gonna die here. I mean here. I'm waiting. You did it. The prophecy came true. Thank goodness I killed this thing. Yay! Alright, Pringles, you're going back in. Remember how the story goes again? What story? This one. <laughs> oh. I know how it goes. Cause I'm a freaking genius. Well, Why does it keep I'm confusing stupid. me? I'm pissed off. I'm I'm pissed off. I'm pissed on. You're what? <laughs> uh <laughs> tried to confuse me, said I was already confused, and then- you snapped out of confusion? <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness I crit it. Did we get a boost? No. I can't believe you almost got outplayed by an ace trainer. Almost, I did get outplayed. Outgunned! Outmanned! Outnumbered, outplanned! There's a deli bird! You know that's its tail, not a bag. Yeah. So it's pulling out its poop whenever it gives you a present. Yeah, that's why some of them are really good and some other ones are really bad. <laughs> you don't want to fight the deli bird? Oh wait. Uh, what I do want to do is... Get bitches. Oh, get flybug back out. Yeah, might as well. And then... Heal up our... Our children. Oh, we actually have half male, half female. Yeah, that never happens. Yeah. Didn't the last LP we had like a shit ton of men? I think so. The fucking Bay ass sausage party. Oh, is this another fucking deli bird? No. It's, it's a, a man food. food. A man food is. Me when someone tries to steal my food? <laughs> Mine food. <laughs> I bet that one took you all day to come up with. <laughs> oh, it took me two seconds. Wait, there's a hidden grotto up there, you see it? Oh yeah, I do see it. 
I think that's the hidden grotto that, uh... <laughs> Dragonite. Yeah. Oh. I'm a backpacker. <laughs> <laughs> that is so true, girl. <laughs> I feel you. Vanillite. Why is this thing level 45? <laughs> I don't know, it's just built different. I think this thing takes forever to evolve. No, it definitely should have been evolved by now. Should it? I don't know. It shouldn't be its uh, last evolution, but... Uh, you have a Vanillite and a Buffalon. What's all a Buffalon? It's just, you go from an unevolved, weak Pokemon to a freaking Ox. Leave him alone! Oh no. He's, he's gonna use bulldoze and crit me and I'm he's gonna trying die. his best right now man never mind he's dead damn we're almost at level 50 man yeah I don't say a chance if I fight I mean I'm a backpacker <laughs> forgot my script <laughs> you can't ride that! You Fungus! You need to pee pee up. You need that. No, I don't. I know you don't. Hey, it's a gold duck! <laughs> not a psychic type. Yeah, you, you ever thought that was weird that it's not a psychic type? Yeah, a little bit. I. It turned me into a water type. It turned me into a pickle morty. It was the funniest shit I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Wait, is this still super effective to me? Nope. I guess it just turns you only into a, a water type. Yeah, pure water now. It's really cool for it to do that. That's a fungus. <laughs> Among us. Oh, it's an Amoongus. Yeah, we're at the we're at the time. They're they're mature now. <laughs> 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 I haven't played Among Us in a while. I just crashed my heat into it. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> You're not very good at Pokemon, Cameron. Oh. What are you learning? Head smash. Bex, oh, it's a rock type move. Yeah. The user attacks the target with the hazardous full power headbutt. The user also takes terrible damage. Alright, we have not used assurance a single time. I can't wait to see us get, like, half damage from that. Yeah. Alright, find a deli bird to go crash our head into. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Careful. Careful. Hey, careful, Spongebob. Careful, 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 careful. Right. Why would you battle him? I was gonna end the episode. <laughs> we'll end it here in just a second. I'm hungry. <laughs> so am I. I, I want to beat up. I want to beat them up and go see what's on the end of the reading rainbow here. How about I make the burgers and you make the fries? Okay. Oh, I won't overcook them this time. Yeah. It said on the bag to do it for 18 to 20 minutes, so I put them in for 17 minutes, and they got overcooked. Please tell me how that works. You didn't toss them? No. I just put them in for for 18 minutes, or in, 17 in minutes. In the air fryer? Yeah. And they were, like, freaking, they were, like, they were cooked for, like, 30 minutes. You know how I make the fries? I press the fry button on the air fryer and then throw my fries in there. <laughs> works every time. <laughs> I don't know how to read instructions. You already know that from how I make taco bowls. That's true. This you this wanna... this girl decides to use uh, like the taco seasoning mix, which is which is all all fine and good, but uh, she decides, oh, uh, I'm just gonna throw the seasoning in there on the raw meat and just let it cook that way <laughs> instead of waiting for the meat to be done. And then throwing it in there. <laughs> well, it made sense. How does it make sense? Please tell well, me. Well, you season meat before you put it in the pan. I mean, I guess I can't argue with that. 
Oh! We got all of our stats boosted by Ominous Wind. Hey, you're lucky last time I did it, I actually added water instead of just adding the shit of power. <laughs> oh my gosh. I mean, that's why I made a lot all the time, and you're like, oh, this is pretty good, and you keep eating it. It was freaking spicy when you did it that way. And you, even you complained about it. You were like, you're like it's, it's so spicy. I thought that's how you did it. What's over here? You gonna get the item? Yay, All yay. that for a freaking calcium? That's it. I'm, Fly back I'm today. flying back. <laughs> I'm out of here. I'm gonna boop you. Boop. Alrighty. Uh, heal up our Pokemon. Meow. I keep. I, I was like. I was like. Oh yeah. Let's go catch on. Or uh, let's go see the Pokemon that we caught. And then I was like, Wait. This we, isn't a nutslack. Yeah, we didn't catch shit. Yeah. One thing I do want to check is I want to check the the vendor here to see if they have any cool TMs. All right. Oh yeah, we won't be able to get the sword Pokemon until after the gym. Yeah. What do you have to say? Wow, seriously, you're jealous and can use Surf. Cool, seriously, I give mad props to you. You're you ride and jealous and jealous and is ridden. The vibe between you and your Pokemon is insanely awesome. Me, I sink like a rock, so seriously, no thank you to the sea and waves. He has so much to say. Oh, he doesn't have TMs. Bro, he's got greet mail! I can greet someone through the mail now! That's so useful! Dear pesky plumbers, the Koopalings and I <laughs> Alright. Well, got through got through a good bit this episode. We we uh clashed with Team Plasma. They just like hit us with their ice nuke and yeah. Uh, and they, and they they were like, they were like, oh yeah, we need those DNA splicers. And Drayden was like, no, -uh. oh, e god. And then he's like, no, -uh. and they're like, fuck you, me, no. -uh. And then they took it anyway. Yeah. So I'm I'm upside down now. Yeah. And the next one, uh, probably go find where Marlin is. Yeah. No, no clue. Did we where even he's try at. the gym? Did we what? Did we even try the gym? Usually they yell at you, saying like, oh, he's not in right now. No, I didn't even go in there. Go in and see if they yell at you. What, right now? Yeah. Alright, fine. It's gonna take two seconds. <laughs> oh, they do yell at you. You're going to the gym leader who went swimming off into the ocean, yelling about the sea. Please look for him if you like. I think he went down. I don't remember. I don't really remember this part of the game that much. Well, anyways. And the next one, we'll go find him. Go, actually, I don't think. I think we have to go up and uh, do stuff because it's just like every other game. Uh, the seventh gym is when you go do all the con big conflict stuff. Yeah. So I assume we'll probably find him when we do the conflict stuff with Team Plasma, and I mean, then. Uh, this is the eighth gym. Yeah. You said the seventh. After the seventh gym. Oh. Yeah. Well, this is the calm before the storm, before shit gets real with Team Plasma. Yeah. So, we'll see how the shit gets real in the next one. Alright. Bye-bye! Bye! -bye. Bye.